Hello world, I'm LJ and this is LJ Go Sweden. Today I am again here at this road next to me on this side. We basically have a yeah, arrangement of houses. I was going through there because I hoped to maybe get yeah on a different track through the forest. Uh, maybe to get on a spot where we can um, watch the sunset because as you can see there's clear sky today which is actually very rare depend like if I compare it to the most days that I've been here so far but yeah unfortunately of course nobody was walking through there just um, some animal trails and yeah so we are here now on the road not on the road but next to the road and it's really cold so we have minus 15 degrees right now during the day i feel my nose like all the nose hair becoming like frozen ah yeah okay so well what am i going to talk today about um so i tried to like rethink the whole um, day that happened yesterday at the company in Ernschotz week and um, yeah so what have I done so far to like maybe relax a bit not get too worried I have um, talked to some friends yesterday I'm also going to talk to more friends today I um, yeah I sent an email to the hiring manager this morning and um, just to say again like thank you for all the things that I'm like interested in the um yeah the plant and all those things so that she has like a good yeah that she just has has like feedback from me because the the, the situation yesterday when she had another meeting was just like goodbye and no talking about what's going to happen next so now maybe she will give me a response and tells me like yeah i will contact you in the next week or something like that so i don't know and I also contacted uh, the engineering manager that I was, um, yeah, basically the, um, at the company the whole day that, um, yeah, and I connected with him on LinkedIn. So maybe that, yeah, will calm me down a bit and maybe it will work out. So I don't know. Like, I, I really tried to think about it. And I thought like, okay, I'm I'm looking forward to it. So the only thing that really annoys me now is not um, the fact that I might get rejected. It is more the fact that I just don't know what, um, like how I'm planning my next weeks. Because as of right now, wait, there is a street right here, but the truck is going straight. So <clears throat> the thing right now that I'm um, not very enjoying is just the fact like that I don't know what about Christmas um, so I was um, yeah thinking okay maybe yeah go before Christmas and then come back here to Sweden to Sundsvall um, right during the Christmas day or the first or the second Christmas day I don't know and then I still have time to see Sundsvall and also start looking for apartments if I get the job and if not then yeah we will just see if something else happens but the big problem with that is uh, I just don't know um, if I should do it and if I should even extend my stay here in Sundsvall because as of right now my Airbnb room is rented till the 31st of um yeah december so i'm not even pl like scheduled to stay here for new year's eve but in my mind i'm already planning that so i probably should buy a few days already um, for the next year if they are available i have not looked yet because i was too scared to maybe get thrown off my my plan more um yeah so i really don't know I am, yeah, I just feel a bit like <laughs> overwhelmed with too much information because there's no, there's no right or wrong in this way, you know, it's, yeah, there's no perfect decision making. 
and that annoys me. <laughs> yeah, okay, but now um, one good thing, one good information. I have made it to the second interview round for Northwold, so for um, the job at the Gigafactory in Skellefteå, very far north. Like, I think it's even above the polar circle, so the Arctic circle, so yeah. I don't know if this is then my second biggest hope right now. I, I think so it is because I have, yeah, made the most um, work with them. Like if you rank all my, all my good applications. Yeah, so I will have another job interview with one of the engineering managers at Northwald next Monday. So this is December 18th. And yeah, that is also like the day where I was planning to go home. So yeah, okay, so I'm not actually like thinking that this is possible anymore. But yeah, so that is the North Wall thing. And then also I had the opportunity to do some AstraZeneca assessments today again, uh, because I have applied for more than just one job with them. But unfortunately, the whole calculation process that I was talking in one of the late and uh, earlier videos, I was not able to redo this. So the not so good results from back then, they were kept, so no chance to adjust. I had to redo the, the personality test where they were like telling me, okay, you are fitting to the company or you're not fitting. And I even made slightly different responses compared to the first one and still I got a, a low correspondence to the yeah to the people working there so I'm not a good fit based on my yeah, personal behavior okay so I did not bother too much because all that um, yeah worrying about that has been done a few weeks ago but besides that Everybody in our house is sick right now. So I also feel like I get another like infection from other people. I also was on the train yesterday where a lot of people were just sneezing and coughing and I was like, oh, wonderful. <laughs> yeah, so we will see what will happen. And yeah, so I have applied for like one more job today, but I really just try to search for for the, the diamonds in the applications um, in the job postings so we will see how that goes and yeah i think that's all i can tell you today but yeah i just hope that i can make or tell myself and also you guys when i have a plan you know when i just can tell you this is the plan for the next two weeks this is going to happen and it will happen but as of right now i really just feel like i am living every day without knowing what's going to happen this day or the next one yeah i also have um i would not say a negative um message but the, uh, the second opportunity that I had like during Christmas maybe um, like one of the people from the house could take me further north to their family um, that also is now not possible anymore because um, the sister of one of the yeah people living there she had like decided to make the family gathering somewhere else and now they have to rent like a hotel and they don't do it in their in their large um, vacation house villa thing anymore so yeah there's no space basically she still told me like yeah we, we could make it like figure something out if you um, yeah are staying in Sweden for Christmas you don't have to be alone on that day so yeah I'm really <laughs> I don't know it just feels it just feels really weird I don't know I just don't that's that's usually like also the reason why I like to plan um, for Christmas or for New Year's Eve too what I'm going to do because I don't like this 
feeling of not knowing what's going to happen for, for those days because they are special. People said they are special, so they have to be special. Um, societies basically said they are special, yeah. Okay, but now I'm already thinking too much again. We made it back here to this area. And that is a good spot to say goodbye. So have a wonderful day and see you tomorrow. And just like that, the video continues. It's now 4 p.m. and I received an email from the hiring, hiring manager from Sun Mina, so the company that I was, yeah, basically walking around yesterday at. And they said they want to make me an offer. So I am just so excited. Um, they were asking me for my salary expectations. So I was talking to one of the people here in the house, what I should do, because of course I don't know the Swedish like usual way how to do it i don't even know the german way <laughs> because i don't have too much experience in germany either but yeah so i responded and now i just hope that it will work out um she was telling me like that of course there are a lot of other people that have to approve this it's a bigger company they have 250 people working there so yeah but i really really hope it will work out and yeah so this would be the perfect end basically to my story so i would be really happy if that will work out so oh, okay but with that now that's time to say goodbye oh you can see this it's ah it's annoying me for so long already i'm sorry i'm just too excited right now <laughs> but yeah see you later so have a good one and yeah, hopefully I can tell you tomorrow that I might have a contract incoming.